hello hello everyone welcome back to my youtube channel i'm zui i'm here i want to take us through how we can do enlargement using radial method and before you, you continue i just kindly subscribe uh kindly subscribe to my channel if you haven't done so i request you to do so so that uh, you be updated and be be given a notification anytime i upload something new now a question that we are going to handle here is draw a quadrilateral of the following given information to a scale of 2 to 1 using radial method ab is 30 millimeter bc is 25 millimeter ad is 35 millimeter and angle at a is 100 degrees and angle at b is 120 degrees so how do we go about this uh, when you want to enlarge that is to a scale 2 to 1 using radio method first of all we shall get to draw our given quadrilateral and this is how we go about it we can draw it here this is the baseline and on this baseline we can identify a point this is point a and then we measure 100 degrees at point a This is a hundred next we can have a b which is 30 millimeter so we measure a b this is b then we have we have angle b as 120 so we can have our angle here it's 110 and 20 here it is we can complete this line then we have bc as 25 millimeters so we can have our bc let's use our compass 25 millimeters a pair of compass this is C then we have our AD as 35 so we measure that 5 and we cut So this one is uh, point D. So we can join D to C to get our quadrilateral. So this is a quadrilateral that we want to draw to a scale 2 to 1, meaning we are going to increase it. So the steps here are first of all, draw, have a point. Of enlargement let me say this is my point of enlargement just somewhere near the object not really the object but the figure then we draw radial lines through every point so the first line from that point can pass through a the second line passing through B The third line passing through C. And the fourth one passing through D. Sorry, it's like a diagram is going to pass through what we just written there, but doesn't matter a lot. Now, the next thing we shall do is we have another line at this point of enlargement. We can call it M, on which we are going to put our scale. Just at any angle, let's say we can have our line going this direction. We have our divisions. This is 1. We can elongate it, first of all. So this one is 
at any equivalent uh, convenient length this is one and this is two that's the scale and we can call this one two so for this case we shall join the nearest point to our original point it means we want to start from one then we increase by two so we can draw a straight line from a to that point so once we have this way we are going to put our to have another point that is a replica of a after enlargement that means it has to come from two so how do we go about it we are going to translate or just to shift this line one to a to move up to two so it moves from here so that it begins at two so let's shift it and it shifts up to there these are parallel lines and now this one becomes our new point a prime our new point for a and from there we are going to move a d again the same same procedure so that once it moves it begins where at a we can first of all realign then we shift it we can support then that just shift it so that it begins from a and as it begins from a it should go up until it meets that line that passes through d so here it is we can draw it as it goes up let it meet that line that passes through d once it reaches there we can call this d prime next we are going to move from d a line that is parallel to dc to meet this line so we are going to have this again realign it and then just slide it upwards to look for point d so here it is so here it is we can still again repeat we can repeat i mean if you are not so sure we can still start again then again look for it here it is just move it and draw it so that straight line it has to meet this straight line so we can elongate this just elongate this side then again we just bring this other line to meet it somewhere there so this one becomes our point c prime once we are there we are going to bring point uh, C to come downwards to locate point uh, B. So B is along this line. So we can elongate this because we want to draw our B. Now B is where? Our B is along this line. So it is parallel to. So we, we just draw a parallel line from here parallel to bc so how do we go about it again we realign this and just slightly move slide it downwards until it looks for sorry it has deflected you just look for it and move it downwards to look for c once it finds C, we bring it down to meet this line. So this one becomes our point B prime. Now, 
a point A prime and B prime can just be connected because they are parallel to this. So it's just a straight line parallel to this. Draw it. So this is our new quadrilateral whereby we can now join our lines. So the first line is here. The second line is here, and our third line and lastly This is how we use radial method to enlarge a given uh, shape. Thank you very much for watching. Consider subscribing to the channel.